Hey there, everybody, and welcome back. All right, thank you yeah, for coming back. Yeah, all that good stuff, all the mushy stuff. All right, today I bring to you a third party, an oldie but goodie, but I thought I'd finally do him. It is the Bag Cubes Brawny. This is the version two. I missed out on the version one, so I thought I'd get this one. And guess what? He comes with accessories. Yes, I know, it's hard to believe. Uh, first, we'll show off his little gun, or he's got a big cannon. Uh, nothing special. Just brown, uh, brownish, or not brownish, but I guess grayish. Kind of thing. has got some details. Well, nothing special. Just that. Does come with a little welder. Comes in, it'll fit on his hand. Pretty neat. Nothing special again. Just little details. That's about it. Comes with a thing that goes on the front, a little drill. I'll show y'all later. But once again, nothing, no paint or nothing, nothing special. Comes with a gas can. Once again, it does carry a little pistol in there. It hides away, which is pretty cool. But once again, nothing, no paint or nothing special. And he comes with a faceplate with a grr. I'm gonna get you sucker kind of face. So it's got some silver paint, which looks good. Uh, I don't know if this, I had this with them, but I don't know what this goes to. To tell you the truth, to be honest, but it came with it, I think. So there you go. Well, all right. Well, I had quite a few accessories, but uh, let's go ahead and talk about this guy. And here he is with the drill in front. It doesn't turn. That's not cool. But and there's it with the gas can out right there. So. From that one time, I guess, cartoon, you can drill through the mountain. Yeah. All right. As you can tell, he does have four wheels, so he will roll. All right. All right, all right, all right. And let's look at the front. It's got some paint right here, some yellow paint right there. I wish they would have painted the lights, maybe. That would have been cool. I think that's silver. It's pretty good. It's got a little green darker green uh, paint thing right there, but mine's got a chip or something in it, I don't know, unsightly. Some yellow right there, it's got the hubcaps are painted right there, and yellow right on, on that, and that's about it. This is really a plain looking kind of, uh, you know, we got the windows, but not trying to lose it. I wish they would have put the black, you know, still black right there like that. I'm gonna put it black like that, it would've been pretty cool. But it's nothing special. I mean, it's just, it looks like a 60s, 70s hippie van that you would go camping in or something or go across the country. And I don't, you know, it's kind of a, kind of not what Braun looked like in G1, but, you know, it's, I like what they did. It's all right. Oh, he's got silver up here on the things right here. So, not much paint at all, but, you know. And that is Brownie. All right, here he is next to Crapagonics as always. And he's a you know, MP size, so that's pretty cool. It does have some, um, is that paint? Did they paint them? Yeah, I don't think they painted them. Well, that's sad. They could put silver right there or something. These are flexible, so that's cool. But yeah, there he is next to Crapagonics. As you can tell, he can hold his weapons pretty good. So, no issues with that. Alright, back from transformation, and let's take a look at this little feller. Look at that head sculpt. Looks pretty good. As you can tell, he has silver paint. He's got some blue eyes. He does look down a little bit, not much. Looks up, uh, breaks the sculpt up a little bit, but not too bad. I mean, it's, not, it's good. And it has a swivel. I like this little thing behind him. And he has arm movements up to here. Comes on tab. That's not cool. But it is kind of sturdy. I like that. I like how the transformation comes all together in the chest and it transforms. It's not that bad of a back cube transformation, but we'll get that to later. It does go all the way. Got a lot of soft ratchets. It does have a double joint uh, elbow, which is good. Does have uh, all of the fingers on the pin, all that good stuff. 
and it does have a swivel and it does have a bicep swivel and it does have a waist swivel and that's good and you can have a little I guess an ab crunch if you put a little bit it won't mess up the sculpt too much but that's good it's got some black paint right here I put a little Autobot sticker uh, there's no paint up here this could use some um, repo labels um, does all the Van Dam. So that's good. I uh, can't go all the way back because of the hood, or I'm sorry, the top of the car. Does go all the way like that. Does have a, a knee bend, which is good. Uh, it's got a toe tilt up and down, and it's had a good, got a decent rocker, pretty good rocker. I don't like these. These do not stay in that well. I don't know what the problem is, but yeah. It kind of cleans up pretty good in the back. It's not bad. You know, I got this little thing right there, and the wheels uh, protect it from. You can see the other side, so that's pretty cool. And the and the gas can. And now, when I first looked at this, you know, it had a big old gap in here, all that stuff. And um, but now you can add, you can split the gas can that had the gun in it, and you can put it in there. So um, that's that's brilliant. You know, you know that's. I wish a lot of other uh, companies looking at you, uh, Hasbro. Hunt returns, uh, fill in gaps like that. Looks good. So yeah, looks good in the back. Uh, this is painted for some reason. I don't, I don't know why, but yep. But very, very minimal paint. Where's guy? But he looks good for Braun. I like it. That's there. All right. All right. Here he is with some other bronze I have. You got the Titan Return little Titan Master, the G1 Braun. Uh, these are the classic ones, uh, the Takara one and the Hasbro one, Titan Returns. Um, this is x Braun. I know he's not Braun, in, you know, per se, as a, these Braun, but, you know, and I think there's a Braun that was a, a movie character, too, or not a, not in movies, but one of the movie extras, whatever, but I couldn't find him, so he's somewhere. But uh, this is, I think, all the Brawns I have. It's not very many of them. He's not showing a lot of love, but there you are. And here he is with some of the, I think all the mini bots I have right now. And, you know, so there he is. It looks, looks awesome. I, I need to get some more mini bots. I need sea spray. I need pipes. Uh, I need some other ones. I need, I got Warpath, but he's a big guy. So I don't know if I really consider that one, but I do have him, but he's somewhere. But anyways, rambling. <laughs> all right. Final thoughts on this guy. He's pretty good. Um, the weapons are cool, you know, they're, they're nothing, you know, right home about. They really don't have any paint on them. Uh, but, you know, they're cool for Braun. I don't remember him having a, a weapon, but, you know, uh, whatever. Uh, materials, they're, they're, they're fine. Um, I didn't feel like anything was going to break. Uh, I don't like that these don't stick out. I mean, they don't stick in all the, you know, all the way. And they come out very loo uh, loose all the time. Um, but other than that, materials felt pretty decent except for this little hood right here this part right here when you're trying to lift it up and everything it's, it's just like on that little um, hinge right there and the first time you try to pop it out it, it's really tight so um, I felt a little uh, shaky about um, doing that but you know it was after I got it out there it was it was okay uh, paint very minimal uh, you know there is a couple of paints you know lots over here you know stuff like that um, but there's not, how, not a whole lot, uh, but it, you know, where it is, it is put on there pretty good. So, you know, not too bad, but wish there could have been some more paint. Uh, the transformation, uh, it's pretty, pretty neat. Um, I like the, uh, like I said, the coming in the chest, you know, it all comes in together and the legs were pretty cool. I don't like, like I said, I don't like that, but I love the, the fill in with the gas tank. That's brilliant. I wish a lot of, you know, other companies would do that. That would be pretty cool. Uh, the articulation is pretty good for a little mini bot. You know, he's he's got some decent articulation. It's not bad. Um, the alt mode is meh. You know, it's kind of plain, and it kind of looks like Braun, but not you know not really. You know, I don't know if you get what I'm saying. It's it's just it's just a weird looking Braun, but you know, it's the best we got. At right, you know, I think it's the only one we got for MP. Uh, hopefully, somebody else will do it. This I think this could be a filler, uh, but if we don't ever get another Braun. I'll be satisfied. That's fine. So I'll give him probably uh, seven and a half Hellback cubes. You know, it's not not the greatest, but you know, it's pretty good. You know, I would I would recommend it if you don't have a a brawn.
you know. So, all right. Well, I'm gonna get on the floor. You know what time it is. Come down there, join me. You know, be my neighbor. All right. All right. Well, like I got like I was talking about Huff whenever I was doing you know the short man complex, you know, and all that stuff. Braun really had it. You know, he was, you know, Billy Billy badass throughout the um, cartoon, trying to be you know and all that stuff. But then he got killed with one shot in the back. I mean, you know, it busts out a window. That's all it did, you know. Like, Megatron, Decepticon, you know, all that stuff. And he gets, patoo, and shot right in the back, and he's dead. It's like, what the heck? What, why, why, why did they just, I don't know. I know why, because they want to make room for new, car, you know, new, you know, toys and stuff. But that was just a bad way to go out for old Brawny. I mean, I wonder why they picked Braun there anyways. They could have picked any other, you know, um, mini bot. I don't know. I mean, I guess he was just, you know, one of the tough ones with the iron high and all that stuff. So I can see why they picked him, but just weird. I don't know. It's a sad way to, for Braun to go out. All right. I just was going to kick my Rogers butt a little bit. Combiner Wars. That's all you gotta say. So, all right. Well, that was my floor time. Hope y'all liked it. Hope you liked my review. He's pretty good. He's decent. Seven and a half hell uh, bad cubes. Um, I think he's worth picking up. I was late to the game and I got him, you know, the version two. But I'm glad I got him. Uh, I'm, I'm glad he's in my collection. I like it. All right. Go down there and hit me up with some comments. Hit that like button real hard. It's all free. Um, thank y'all very much. Um, I guess until next time, I'll see you in the next review. Hell Hasbro, Hell Transformers, all that good stuff. And uh, good night, folks. I got shot in the back. In the back. Come on. Bear.